actually Lincoln or Lars, Whatever. I feel like as chief military officer, Jordan definitely can stop you from coming down into the fusion core. Yeah, but I've got muscles. Yes, but I have muscles Training. and badge. Yeah. <laughs> no, badge is a skill. No, I know. Yeah, so I, just, just I, just pictured, I just pictured Jordan saying, but I have muscles and badge. <laughs> no. Which is <laughs> like a shot. <laughs> you have to obey me. I point to the badge tattooed on my muscles. <laughs> Through I can the make a dance. space suit. Through the space <laughs> suit. You know it's there. My, my pointing is extremely authoritative. A custom... See through patch. Yeah, to show off <laughs> to the show badge. Off. There's a little arm window. <laughs> Is it the same one that shows off? You're supposed to put your hat. driver's license in. There. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. We have we have like more fashionable spacesuits customized for people's uh, personal tastes. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, while they're distracted, I start moving away towards the fusion. Core. Yeah, we're going. Okay. Yeah, I'm look, this is. I guess I'm going this with is you guys. A, a I time was sensitive. Oh, issue. We're not. Yeah. We're not. You're going. We're I'm going. going. You. I'm. He's going. I'm, I'm going. staying he, out of that. He's refusing to listen to me. I'm Just keep an eye on Jordan. There's While they do their work. I really don't want to have to do okay, something we're both going to regret. We'll just regret. do it. I'm past the point of Where caring. are... We've already, we've already I, gone. Yeah, they're already gone. Why you guys just see, like... You guys are, like, talking while you're walking. <laughs> if, if noticing that you both are coming with us, I go, well, then why doesn't everybody just come? And the captain stays in the control room. Sure. Yeah, I just, so, yeah. I just so want to see it. Right. So I'll, I'll stay I, with. I mean, I'll stay here with the captain, keep him company. Yeah. Sure. You'll they'll just they'll just be here while I'm sure. jacking into the sure. computer. So good. We happy? We good? Great. Can we work on living now? All right, let's yeah. go down. Okay. Life support I is good. I just want to see it. Okay. <laughs> so we so, so we move down. You four, after much deliberation, oh, yeah. make oh, it crap. down together to the fusion core. <laughs> You notice in your in, with your sensors in your spacesuits that the outside air is starting to get very stale. It's a mm. very good thing that you guys switched to the suits. Yeah. Otherwise, you'd be having a couple problems right about now. So you can tell from those sensors? Yeah. Okay. Um, it's some stank air. I ironically begin playing air supply. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Uh, you go down to the fusion core, and care. it's in the same state that it was in before, okay. where the main piece... Still broke. Move. It's broken, and it requires very specific pieces from Earth. Right. The, there uh, it is. The backup power generator is still running. So there's after no being way to. Repaired it. by Sally. Right. Well, okay. Sally so there's and. There's no way to put the power repair. back on because we can't do it no. manually and we can't do it digitally. There is. We just have to make. We just have to make the backup generator link into the systems. The backup. Isn't it? The backup generator is currently part of the system. Yeah, there there's other generators running at the rod. I thought we turned those off. Well, we need to like no, bring never, those. No, we didn't turn those off. Goddamn. Oh, oh so, so someone needs to go back up to the rod to turn those off. Is that? And no. then Maddie will be power. No. No, we can just what's going on. What? make the main power to that generator. Oh, I thought the, we turned the generators. Off. No, the generators in the rod were sustaining life support where this one shouldn't have been able to. Mm -hmm. So yes. So we have so to we turn that back on. No, they're on and they need to keep so running. I thought. That we, have no we were trying so to go to the data center to like override Maddie's blackout on the control center or the control room and life support. Well, she's, like, she shut down the system Maddie. entirely. That was the right, and center. we need to go to the data center to turn it back on because we have power, so there's no reason for us to be in the fusion reactor. Right. That is smart. That makes sense. You're yeah. in the control. No, that makes sense. Oh, okay. okay. That makes sense. So, so there's, we, just go so there's a, a We only went down, down here to show here. Lars it's broken. <laughs> yeah. Hold on. Yeah. So yeah. Lars, <laughs> learn from this. Just where's take the, it in. Just take it all that's, in. That's take what I was wondering. Notes. Like, where's the take reset? Pictures? Where's the reset switch on the whole system? Like, where's the, you know, turn it off, turn it on again? Well, there is a reset power. Well, I mean, you can cycle power with the backup thing. But it's not providing power for the whole system. It's only providing power for a number of systems. You, however, do not know which systems it's providing power to. Is there any way I can jack in and change those? Or am I locked out? You are locked out of that. Okay. Because there is no power to any monitors, and the whole base seems to not have power. The whole base doesn't have power. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's why there is no life support. Wait, then... But the backup generator is on. The backup generator is on providing power for something. Okay. For something. Okay, we need to figure out what that something is then. Yeah, we do. Okay, okay, let's go to the data center and hack in and try to figure out what's going on. Okay, okay. perfect. So, 
So there are yes, screens in the data center? Do? Can I hack into the generator really quick and see what that something it is powering? Unfortunately, no. the no. monitors are down. We're oh, locked okay. down. It is providing Wait. power and power alone. Wait, I can't even uplink in? No. Okay. No. Okay, so we're it going to... It is simply to on. It's like, it's like a generator nowadays yeah. where it's plugged into something. Right, right, right. It's okay. plugged into the it wall. It just goes. It it's does its own thing. Pow- it's providing power. power. Something. It's been turned on. You don't know what it's power. Okay. Mm-hmm. Will the data center have power for us to access things? I don't know. You haven't been there. Let's go check it out. I mean, everything is also turned off. So did when I was down there, but we were down there ago. before yeah. all the power came on. May I interject very quickly, even though yes. I'm not in the game? Yeah. Sorry. So, did I misspeak? No. Something? I'm just wondering. Lars is a maintenance person, right? Yes. And you said he has a pod kit. Yep. I have enough if, utility pod. If this is built like any other system of any base or any large thing, he should have a tool in his kit that detects live power lines. Oh, yeah. yeah. Which it, means well, yeah. if it's and like any other system, Power's if you own a panel, there's always multiple wires that are color-coded to the systems that they go to. So oh. shouldn't he from here be able to know what system point, the power point. is being provided to? Yeah. It's and wouldn't like his expertise allow him to know yeah. this? Yeah, okay, all right, that's a good point. Yes, he can do that. Oh, did you? All right, Zach. That's a good Wait, you then why didn't you, you just say anything? Did you really? Did you really? Because I went, uh, because... Oh, sure. Uh-huh. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. You figured that out long beforehand. Oh, yeah, oh, that's yeah. exactly oh, yeah. what I was doing. All right. Sorry, you can edit that. Do you, do you wish <laughs> to look at the panels, Lars? I do it very quietly without... Very quietly without while they're, do, while yeah. they're <laughs> going they're, over there like, they're like How the do data I, center. I can't compute it without I'm, compute it! I'm just gonna go kind of <laughs> look and go, mm. So you <laughs> pull out <laughs> your resistance monitor to check to see if there's voltage going to the various wires, and wire that you know goes to the data center is active. Oh! Oh. Hey, computer idiots! <laughs> <laughs> Power's going to the data center. <laughs> is it? Is it Lars? Are you hey. sure? Are you sure the cables aren't crisscrossing in your mind? Hey, you know what the color blue means? The color green means the color. You went to kindergarten, right? So you see here <laughs> that I explain the thing. I'm not. I'm not convinced you're not just seeing colors and everywhere. That's why I'm the most helpful. <laughs> uh, Let's go. Uh, <laughs> okay, right. so Good. you guys see from Good your <laughs> from your spacesuit sen- uh, uh, space <laughs> sensors oh that the air in the base is now uninhabitable. You cannot breathe this air. Shit. Okay. But it's still there. You two <laughs> in the control room. A screen us, lights uh, up. Us, us two. Us two. Wait. Are no. you there? No, yeah. I went with Lars. Oh, you went he would not let Lars go down Walter, without a babysitter. The quad. Daryl. The quad arm. You are in the room. In right. control. So, are you going to do anything? Mr. Masterson. I'm going to continue to, uh, like... Screen black. I, I'm going to keep trying at it. Okay. Doing what I can. I, Nothing happens because hey, there's no room I gotta keep trying. in the entire moon screen, base. This is the point where yeah. Walter hits I, him over the head with the monitor. I, I know, just I know. Like, Sorry. <laughs> They're doing a conversation, Mr. and then after that, the screen will light up. Alright, Mr. Masterson, who... What's up, Walt? Who do you think it is? The saboteur? Who else? What else? I don't know. I I mean I'm I haven't been with the company super long. But cuz I yeah, I'm pretty recent, right? I don't know, are you? Wait, are you? You're a new No, school? no, I'm I'm new to the moon base. Yeah. Like I'm new to be working with you guys. I've been with the company a while. I I only know about each of you what I've what I've read. I mean, I don't have any any basis for for an opinion at this point. Well, everyone's done like done their job well, and like nobody's done anything like suspicious. Well, that's what about? Huh? I mean, no, what, I mean they have. What about get past the numbers? What about the people? <laughs> what do, what do I feel about the people? What's my gut instinct? Yeah, I mean, a number can't tell you everything. That sounds like irrational talk. <laughs> well, uh, yeah, no, I can't tell you everything, but I... They all so seem like I'm good gonna, people. They, they want to they wanna do their job. I'm going to be honest with you, they boss. They want to earn a place here. I don't know if I trust Sally. She's... 
Well, she's mean with that coffee maker, let me tell you. <laughs> she's, she's way too chipper through all of this. It just doesn't, don't add up. How, she's a secretary, boss. Why is she even here? She's not a secretary. Isn't that, what, isn't she? She isn't, is she? I'm an assistant. Yeah. She's an assistant tech officer. Yeah, oh. yeah she's an assistant tech. She has, she, she's basically, she's an intern. She's basically, yeah, shadowing the tech officer. Which is why she makes to, coffee to and learn does what all she the work. Can. And knows how to do all the computers. Yeah. Okay, well that actually makes a lot of sense. <laughs> I mean, she, she lets the tech officer take care of most of it, and, and she's just there to observe for the most part, and that's why she's always just there with coffee. <laughs> That's all she does, folks. <laughs> I mean, until just, she until she needs to step in, where she has all, in a in a few spots and few been spots. In few, in few really helpful. Few spots. It just it just seems a little over the top to me. And she's you know she's, she's an got all the top kind of person. She's got all this knowledge about how how Maddie works and what all's going on. But she knows any about well, how she, Maddie. She works? says she turned off the rod, right? How would you do that if you didn't know what was going on? Well, she's. I mean, you I told turned her, it on without me how. what was going yeah, on. She, well, she yeah, bombed that it. Was an accident. She bombed it. She didn't use Maddie's... She didn't know anything about Maddie. She just... Blunt force. Blunt, blunt force turned it off. Like, disabled Maddie's connection to it. I I well, mean, well, all right. I, I know you, how that works, and I'm not that great of an actor. If you say so, boss. Do you have any more to discuss? So, Lars, what do you think about <laughs> who the saboteur might be? Well, I, I told you I'm not too thrilled about... Sally, but if you trust her, I, I suppose I'll, I can live with that. No, I mean your your points are fair. I don't know. So I don't I don't think he'd be Lars. I think he's too, you know. He's not up to it. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I, right? I'll so, say it's unlikely. So okay. So here's here's my reasoning on that. Somebody who's going to be a saboteur is going to come in and they're going to be super straight laced, right? They're gonna they're gonna keep a low profile, and they're gonna be be sort of sort of an average employee whereas Lars is uh, is uh is he's got a big personality he's noticeable does. right sure. and it's not it doesn't fit the profile does, doesn't Jord have uh experience with the military yeah but your Jord is also well I, don't know. I, I mean I, we are I being a, being so. like tormented by a military program on a military base that's a good point I yeah I don't know about your Jord Jord no it's, no, it's definitely Jordan. Yeah. Right. So while you're conversing, a screen lights up with Maddie's face. <gasps> oh. You communists have found these space suits. It seems as though C cutting power to life support cannot kill you. <laughs> Activate. Yes. Boss, <laughs> boss, communists what is he talking have about? taken over the base. The base I'm, has been compromised. Now with, when I, with the system lighting back up, it's just one screen. Uh, it's just one-way communication. Oh Peter, does it flash communists win on the screen? <laughs> <laughs> no, it, it flashes communists like... Communists will like, never win. Communists uh, will never take this space. Like Activating like Operation communists. Moonfall. Where's what? The... What? Do what? Do what? what? Do I know what Moonfall is? Excuse me. Goes black. No! Oh, you guys are... <laughs> Boss, what's he talking about? I don't know. It Maybe sounds like the, the base is going to self-destruct. Maybe I have some The base military. shudders. Yeah. <laughs> the base shudders and you hear a lot of noise from deep below. Oh, shit. Ooh, the moon volcano is active. Are there like explosive charges underneath the base and we're going to sink into the moon? Yeah. No, we're going to shoot Or they're going to send the reactor critical. The reactor's down. So it's you all, guys oh, are yeah. leaving the power center. And is as it, you leave... You notice a bunch of lights spring up from the fusion core behind you. So they haven't uh -oh. even like left the data or left. They're, that they're not at that the whole data conversation center happened yet. as they were. Yeah, we're cool. kind of doing time. Um, sure, uh, it's just I just don't want to place. Gary, yeah, yeah, yeah. Place it correctly. Gary, when uh, fusion core lights up on its own, does it mean it's time to leave? Is that normal? What does it mean? <laughs> Random power jumping to different locations without delegation is always bad. So yeah, I think it's time to go. Yeah. Okay. Do we do we have any Does escape pods? No, we have none, no. right? I already tried. That's the whole point. Yeah. And I and I okay. So Gary, like, we should at least get away from the proximity of. We'll only live a few it, hours in the spacesuits. It's not. It's not going to matter if we can't get life support back on or have a sustainable location. Yeah. We'll just die we'll anyway. So to the room. We have to get Maddie out of the systems. Yeah, so let's go to, to the data, data center. Yeah, let's go to the data center. Okay. You run up to the data center, and you see that one server rack is lit in the corner. 
Mm. Are there multiple uplink ports? Yeah, sure. Sally, There's you're with me. <laughs> four uplink ports. Okay. They can all uplink, though. Stand in well, front of the server. Hmm. I do better on the monitor screen. You go on the uplink, the and I'll cover you. You, you, don't don't have have an you can only access for uplink. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Then that's uplink. It's because it's literally <laughs> just the rack that has power. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh-huh. So you enter into it, and it's um, it's you enter into Laddie's house. Is the standard <laughs> spikes on the floor? It's the standard like... green room. It's very dim and very cold. There's not a lot of power for the simulation, and it's barely running. You go into the living room where you know that Laddie is, and there are black blobs everywhere. I contained this! You contained two of them, which are contained right there in a prison. But yeah. someone must have added a replication protocol to it. Of course. So since there was only one, since there was one survived, it replicated. Okay. Laddie is shivering on the couch. So I can tell you that this is not a containable situation. We need to get Laddie out of here. Or take care of Laddie. Yeah, we, we can create a... The black box. Can I see if Laddie can get more control on things? Can I reinstate her it, control? If you are able to get Laddie into Maddie's mainframe, it might be able to take control. Oh, really? Kind of similar to how on Maddie took control of Laddie. Okay. The reverse. You gotta switch the brain. The old switcheroo. The old switcheroo. Switch Red becomes yellow. Or move her out of the room. Okay, so we're taking her with us. Sure. Okay. Let's get her out of here. Sure. I mean, I was thinking we could just upload her to the black box, but whatever, it's fine. Let's just keep going. Wait, wait upload who? Laddie, never mind. Let's just keep going. Okay. Well, As you approach going. Laddie. <laughs> He's like Sadly. traumatized. Can you put a digital blanket on him? Yeah. Sadly, I am so cold. <laughs> <laughs> but it doesn't sound the happy can... face. Yes, of course it does. <laughs> I can barely I mean, simulate enough for the two of you. Okay, Lally, why do they humanize these AI? Let's go. Who programmed this stupid thing? Is right. it easier to work with? I don't know. Yeah, so we can I actually interface with it. Okay. okay. Right. And not lose our minds. <laughs> Maddie has begun Moonfall. What is Moonfall? Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa back up. Moonfall? Laddie, what is Moonfall? In. The event of total <laughs> communist takeover, Moonfall will activate. The main base can act can act as a rod. Okay. Of course. Shoot the base of the earth. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Duh. <laughs> are you saying that the moon has two rods? <laughs> yeah, the moon has a whole bunch of rods. All right. Anyway. All the rods. Rod. Uh, okay. The fusion oh. core is overloaded and shoots the main base into the earth. Okay, Wait, laddie. Let's get you into the main system so you can stop that from happening. I will try, Gary. <laughs> <laughs> I hate to say I. <laughs>